I'm very proud of what I'm seeing out of Ty, Shanice, uh, Caroline, Olivia, China. You know, they some of those uh, kids have just been here a year, and already you can see that they, they know what we want and they're trying to get it done. So I, I'm real happy and pleased with that. Practice is getting a little easier every day. We're learning new stuff every day. So we're just going through what we have to do and everything. And the coaches are really helping us learn everything. They don't really tell you what you need to do. You just have to watch and learn from your own mistakes and learn what you need to do. They're doing good. They're doing good. They're learning fast. And coach is all about, you know, teaching yourself. So he's not really trying to, he's not really taking a step by step with them. He's, you know, really throwing them out there. So, I mean, they're, they're learning quick, you know, as freshmen. So I think they'll be, they'll be pretty good. I'm just trying to help them understand where they're supposed to be and, if, you know, if they make a mistake, how they can correct it, just make sure they don't do it next time. Um, I'm, I'm not really watching just one person. I'm watching the whole thing, just to see how it materializes and just stuff like that. It's kind of weird because I played against all these girls in high school and stuff, and then now actually playing with them as a team. It's a little different, but we're coming together. We've all played against each other in high school. And so for us to actually all be together and playing, we all played on the same AAU team and stuff like that, to be under – one house and actually being able to build up and the process and stuff, it's amazing. We've got a lot of guards coming back, returning to play. So it's really us trying to help them understand what we're doing and what we're trying to accomplish. And like, we don't have any experience in the post play. So it's, it's about them developing right now and learning everything that we're gonna do on the court, even off the court, I mean, just stuff like that. Last year we had a hard time keeping Olivia on the floor and also China on the floor. So I really don't know if I can start both of those young ladies, even though they might be two of our best, because I need one of them out there to lead us from that two and three position. So that's some of the things we'll be looking at in our exhibition games. I wouldn't be surprised if me and Shanice were playing together some, but uh, yeah, we're really strong at the point guard position. So a lot of us will definitely get a lot of time and you know have our chance to get out there. You can say you have two ball handlers. You know it comes. Great when the other team is pressing the point guard, you know you have somebody else that can handle the ball. So it, it does work at times because, like, at those times, that's when you would probably need another ball handler and, and to bring the ball up. Really, there's more urgency on our rebound and our post play. I'm really kind of pleased with what we're doing on the perimeter. We're making pretty good decisions. We're shooting the ball pretty good, handling the ball pretty good. Uh, but, you know, we when we, we – we're going to shoot a lot of threes, so we've got to cover the boards, and right now we're kind of struggling doing that. I think it's probably one of the toughest schedules I've ever put together. Uh, uh, I, I kind of question myself a little bit why I did that, because, you know, we hadn't got a Kiki, we hadn't got an Ebony, we hadn't got, you know, uh, uh, a Lauren March or a Lake and Leonard and Janae, uh, JJ. We hadn't got any of those kids. So I, I'd feel a lot better going into that because you got that type of leadership. But... Now what I'm seeing on this sideline with those young, those young ladies that we've talked about, you know, I'm getting a little bit more confident in going into this first game. You're not going to believe it. Absolutely not going to believe what's going to take place. We need everybody to be here. The, the more we, we, you know, the band of blues going to be here, you're going to see all kinds of basketball personalities. I think Coach Earl's going to be one of the uh, guest coaches, John Morris, uh, Dr. Loveless. Uh, you know, there's going to be some things take place. And when you leave here, you're going to want to come back and see what happens the next night.